Welcome to the overview of Remedy on-premises to BMC Helix Service Management Migrating Process. Apex Global is migrating to BMC Helix Service Management. Let's follow Johnny and Joe through the process. Hey Joe, it's time to migrate from Remedy Server to BMC Helix Service Management. Great, let's ensure we follow the best practices for a smooth migration. These steps help you understand the migration process, plan and prepare your environment, install and migrate customizations, Move and test your data in phases, validate results, perform cutovers, and go live. First, we need to plan. Reviewing system requirements ensures our environment meets the necessary criteria. Right. We also need to verify infrastructure readiness and security considerations. Let's review our infrastructure readiness and prepare for the new BMC Helix environment. I'll ensure we have access to the necessary resources and containerized applications. Preparation includes setting up the BMC Helix environment, ensuring compatibility, and finalizing migration prerequisites. We need to install the BMC Helix Innovation Suite and Service Management applications first. Got it. I'll follow the installation steps and verify the setup. Installing the core applications ensures the foundation for data migration and configurations. To install these applications, you need to run the BMC provided pipelines. Time to migrate our custom workflows, configurations, and integrations. Ensure all overlays and personalized settings are transferred correctly. Customizations include workflows, plugins, reports, and integrations to maintain functionality in the new system. The next phase involves data migration using Helix Data Manager, HDM. I'll monitor the process and ensure data integrity checks are in place. The initial migration phase moves data while ensuring accuracy and completeness. Now, we need to validate migrated data and apply any fixes. I'll reconcile customizations and ensure everything is functioning as expected. Unit testing is crucial to identify and resolve migration issues before proceeding further. I'll run a Delta migration to transfer the latest updates from the old system. Good. This ensures we don't lose any recent changes before final migration. A Delta migration captures updates, since the initial migration to maintain data consistency. The next phase involves performing an user acceptance test, UAT, to validate that the new system meets business requirements. I'll address any issues and ensure sign-off before the final migration. UAT ensures business functionality and operational readiness before going live. We need to apply a change freeze and validate final data integrity. All set. The environment is stable and ready for the final migration. Pre-final migration ensures a controlled transition with minimal risks. The next phase involves performing an emulated cutover to ensure everything runs smoothly before go live. A final check before we transition fully? The emulated cutover phase ensures system readiness for the final migration. For detailed migration steps, refer to our documentation on docs.bmc.com. Click the link in the video description to access the documentation. Thank you.